You the agent for the church on 86? I'm sorry, I'm late for a showing. I own a, an apartment building around the corner. Why haven't you been able to get a decent tenant in there? We have someone lined up to lease. A homeless shelter, I heard. And churches are tough. People are afraid they'll be haunted by ghosts of sadistic nuns and abused altar boys. So reach out to some businesses. I have. And that property is a disaster. So fix it up. It's a, it's a big space at a great price in an up-and-coming neighborhood. Someone decent is going to want to buy it. It's impossible to heat. The whole exterior needs a renovation. There's no AC. Half the windows are broken. The plumbing is from the 50s. And it's now home sweet home to a small village of drug addicts. You want a better class of tenants in there? You go clean it up. What's wrong? Oh my god, I knew it. I had a bad feeling. I just heard from housekeeping Carla, who's dating that bellboy whose sister works in HR, that people are getting fired. Like, a lot of people. <gasps> Look, all Lena's saying is, you're in a slightly different situation now. You've got a rich dad suddenly and a rich baby daddy. We just don't have the same kind of safety net. I can't lose this job. I don't have anything saved. Can't you ask Rafael to not fire me? Frankie, I... I really can't. When you were tired and needed someone to cover those shifts, I, I did it. And you know I hate this. I fought for you to get this job. You did, but now you can't even fight to help me keep it? It's not my place. Wow. You have changed. Let's go. One, two, three, eyes on me. Stop! You told me I was gonna race the winner, not watch you cap some trucker. And you told us you wanted to do business. Now we got blood ties. Just killing the cell interfaces and we're good to go. You're a genius, Whip. Plan. If I warned you, you wouldn't have come. I'm just here to cut a deal, okay? I didn't sign up for murder. We're sticking our necks out for you on you this. You make the deal happen, I'll make sure everybody gets paid. Wait for a call from Jurgen. Be ready to go where he tells you. Jurgen Richter? Just don't apologize. I won't. I did what I needed to do to take care of myself. I learned a lot. Like, tons of queer girls fall for their best friends. <laughs> Well said. I think she'll let you off the hook. If you ever evolve to Portland, look me up. Count on it.